We've got a disturbing story now in Sumner County. It has parents frustrated with the city of Gallatin's day camp. Parents tell News 4 after their daughter experienced racism for the first time, she was unable to find a camp counselor, so she left camp and walked home without a counselor noticing. Our Dustin Beasley spoke with the parents and the daughter. On the first day of camp with other children arriving, 10 year old Michaela Jones tells News 4 a group of students told her she could not play with them because she was black. Michaela then tried to tell an adult counselor, but none were around. Then Michaela left the building and walked three and a half miles home. I was shocked when she came knocking at my door um, because that was she was the last person I would expect to be here. Um, and when she opened the door, you could see pain in her eyes. I could get walking is one thing, by myself is another thing, but yet so far 3.5 miles, it's, it was scary. One of the children against who the racial allegations are made is a minority. Gallatin Mayor Paige Brown in a statement to News 4 says in part, we are very disappointed that this has occurred and have taken steps to see that nothing like this can happen again. The city of Gallatin's day camp has operated for 27 years without incident. The city has maintained its willingness to provide for counseling for the child. This is a very concerning situation and we are most thankful that the child is safe. We will do our best to assure that it can never occur again. In Gallatin, I'm Justin Beasley, News 4 Nashville.